Come on, boys. Previously on Project Zomboid. It's a nice, tasty Marion outside. Le floor. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another fantastic episode of Project Zomboid. We are Marion Hacksman. I am Vinx. Hello. If you didn't know how to say my name, we are at these skills right now. We're, we're crawling on foraging, but once we get past level 3, it should be a lot easier. That's 100, that's 100 XP we need. Dang. Uh, we just got level 1 cooking. That's kind of hilarious. We have a point six. We almost don't even need to uh, read this little book here. Um, We're almost level 3 nimble. That's really nice. Sprinting is getting up there. Level 5 axes. That's pretty amazing. And we got the extra point into maintenance just in the last episode. Um, If you guys were wondering, yes, I did indeed burn the stew. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Uh, don't be like me. <laughs> don't burn the stew. Uh, other than that, uh, I mean, we still have a lot of food no matter what. I'm going to go ahead and, I don't know, eat this entire pineapple. Sure. Do we have cereal? No. Man, my favorite... My favorite food in this game. Cereal. And soon we're about to have cows. Oh, it's going to be so nice. Uh, let's go ahead and pour that into the bottle. I wonder if it's going to get filled. It might. Yeah. Just, just a bit. Uh, let's go ahead and fill up our... Um, Watering containers. In fact, we're probably going to want these to be filled as well. I mean, everything helps, really. Fill those up with water. So we have a decent supply of it. We can, you know, put stews and soups or whatnot. Soups are really good food in this game. And it also helps a lot in your cooking. I mean, we were essentially... We were able to um, get level 1 cooking just by making stews. So that's really nice. Um, let's fill all of these. Oh, well, let's actually fill all. We're going to get super heavy because there's a lot of water that we're carrying around. But uh, actually, not that heavy. Fairly heavy load. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Sprinting level 1. Hell yeah. Let's go, baby. I think there might be a zombie in those trees. That are just the wind was blowing. In that case, it's not too bad. I was going to say, it should be pretty quiet around these parts. We should be getting that many zombies. Let's go ahead and shove all these in the oven while we still have the oven working. Um, When it comes to generators, ooh, that might get spicy. I don't know, man. We, it might be pretty hard to get a generator. Yeah, we, we might be running with um, no power for a little while, which is unfortunate. Nobody likes to have that happen. Let's get this all boiled. Honestly, we can just keep these in here because the water will never burn. Imagine that. It'd be my luck. It'd be definitely my luck. Anyways, um, yeah, we're just gonna go down the road. Um, we have. I'm. I'm still expecting. Highly, highly, highly expecting the helicopter to come any day. I mean, it's. It's day eight. <laughs> it's day eight. Usually, you can see the helicopter between six and eight. I don't know the exact parameters. I just. I just know that by heart, just by experience. That's just. You know, over a thousand hours of you know, zombie experience. I don't, I don't need any guide to tell me. You know, I don't, I need to look up the mechanics for that. I just know that it's usually around six, six or eight, day six to eight. That might even be the, the exact. I could, I could, I would know. I've never looked that up. Never needed to. I'm sure somebody down in the comments will let me know. But uh, yeah, we're just gonna. Continue on forward. I might cut out some of this 
I might not. I, if I cut it out, you'll you'll know. But I mean, it, it's essentially the same the same walk until we can get a vehicle. Not gonna lie, I might I might get the motorcycle mod. I like the motorcycle mod a lot. I just feel like motorcycles should be in the game. Maybe even bicycles should be in the game. You know. I mean, we're in Kentucky, you know, I feel like it's very, you know, prominent, you know, motorcycle, biker land. I mean, you've got the biker jackets. Why don't we have, you know, motorcycles? It just doesn't make sense. All these bikers, what are they going to, they're all headed into, into their trucks. It just doesn't make sense. These bikers with their lifted trucks. <laughs> What we got here? What you got for me? Twigs? No, 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 no. We have one axe. Um, we can't, we can't make an axe right now. Oh, I guess we need to tear up some, some cloths. Some men of the cloth. All right, we're back, guys. Um, let's go ahead and make an axe. We were only able to find one. I'm sure you guys have act were actually there to see that one. But, uh, ooh, hi, hello there. He's a patriot. Um, yeah, I'd, I'd take that helmet, but... I don't, I don't think I need it, man. I don't think I need the helmet. Like, it's cool, I guess. We can put this on, um, like a mannequin or something. Yeah, we can go ahead and put that on a mannequin later. I like the Authentic Z stuff. I think the Authentic Z stuff is really cool. Come on there, Billy. Come on there, Billy. I want that. Oh, that's damaged, isn't it? Yes, man. Might need a farm around here. You know, find a... Some zombies that will uh, give us some good gear. For the winter. Because we're going to go to a winter. This is probably... This playthrough is 1000% going to go past a year. Without a doubt in my mind. I want this to be my longest playthrough. That's why I'm being as careful as possible. Come on there, buddy boys. Yes. Good. Some weapons, finally. Finally. It's a decent condition, but you know, it is what it is. We'll um go ahead and holster that. I like how it shows. It shows how much is in the magazine. That's super nice. Uh check out back. Yeah. I knew there's gonna be some zombies out here. There always is. For some reason, this place gets flooded with zombies. Get out of here. He's got his Louisville Cardinal shirt on. The crap tap. What was that? Annotated map. Moldrow? Okay. Well, well, we'll keep that on us. I don't really care for Moldrow, but you know, Moldrow is okay. Or Moldrow? I don't know. The proper way of saying Moldrow. I, so, I say Moldrow. Ball sack. Get that in. Okay. Uh, let's put that on you. Put that on my back. And yeah, keep going. Got you. Let's go beat on the zombie over here. Oh, he's he's on that door. Feels bad, man. Uh, a little dangerous. Super dangerous. Basically walked right into him. Oh, hi there, buddy. Uh, 
I was gonna say in before alarm. It's a little bit safer. Oh, this isn't safe though. Tons of zombies over here. See what I tell you? There's like always like little like massive pockets of zombies in this little area. Like like super pockets of zombies. Now it I want to you know next time I do this, I want to do like like really high um rally sizes. That's what I really want to do. I want to do like incredibly high rally sizes for zombies. I think that'd be really cool. Like do like 50 or something, something crazy like that. That way the actual hordes of zombies are actually, you know, quite intimidating. I don't know, I might, I might do that. Might run around through um, some world setting e editing and uh, put that in. I think that'd be a lot of fun. Man, where's the music? I went down that door really fast. Make sure nobody's inside. Kill all the zombies out here. Get them banging on doors. Juggle zombies a little bit. Not too bad, not too bad. Uh, we got a few police officers over here. That's usually a good, you know, a good sign when you see police officers or zombies. That that usually means some weapons at least, whether it be firearms or not. Where are they at? They just kind of hanging out. What are you guys doing? Want to talk about it? That's a nightstick, baby. That's good. Mm-hmm. That's that good stuff. Um. Yeah, let's unload that. Get that nice unloaded. Rack it. And put this in both our hands. That's six shells, man. That's really nice. Let's see. Let's put that on you. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, kill this little group of zombies. See, we're 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 going through, you know, the place pretty pretty well now. Our DPS is really nice right now. Is that the sugar shack? It is the sugar shack. That's uh, that's chiclets. I, I've never seen the sugar shack shirt. If you guys don't know who chiclets is, I'll uh, I'll mention it down in the in the description. Chicklets is a wonderful streamer. She's part of the deep fried brains group that I'm in. Lovely. I think she's going through some IRL stuff right now, so she hasn't been really streaming as much, but she'll be back to it <gasps> soon enough. There we go. About damn time, man. About damn time. Now it's gonna come like crazy. And that's all it takes is just, you need to find the one set of beta blockers. And then once you once you find one thing of beta blockers, then that's it, man. Then you'll find them forever. You'll find them super easy after that. That's usually how it goes. Get datified. Um, yeah. yeah spiffo shirt. I kind of like the spiffo shirt. That was nice. I thought about grabbing it, but I decided not to. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna chill right here. I'm just gonna sit on the ground. Get a little rusty poo. And, uh, yeah. Relax a little bit. That's nice. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and uh, loot these houses, and then probably head home. Because it is getting a little bit late. 
I'd like to get a second watch. Have one watch be, let me know when it's it's um, seven o'clock, and then this watch is gonna wake me up. All right, that's good. You always want to be able to um, dump, do a double rest. I did a little cheeky exploit. Don't worry about it. Don't do it. Don't be like me. I only use it for situations like that. Um. Other than that. Oh my god, Meeks uses exploits. No, I don't. Actually, we don't need that. Sorry, dude. I'll take the money. And the wine. Everybody likes money and wine, right? Uh, Not enough room. Not enough cash, stranger. There's our cereal. That's nice. Some chippy whippies. Let's actually eat those chips. Why not? Some crackers. Tasty, tasty crackers. Um, I guess we do have quite a bit on us, don't we? Hopefully the... Uh, I'll take that jar lid. I said I'll take that jar lid. Thank you. Hopefully the um, helicopter doesn't come here. Damn, really? That's, that's, that's actually insane. That's a shame, man. Usually we have the... Um, the... Station by now? You know, white wine, that's um, that's calories. That's good calories. The ham, that's wonderful. I think that's just like a little laundry room. I could be wrong. Yeah, it might have like... Um, eh, the bleach is nice. If I want to clean. We have really no reason to. That's a good book to have. The journal, eh, don't really care. Let's go ahead and check in here. Nothing. Check this little space right here. Close the door behind us so that uh, zombies don't, you know, sneak our, their ways in. Uh, I don't really want that. Might come back to get the flag or something. Have some, uh, some decor. Some decorations and whatnot. Nothing too crazy. This has an upstairs, right? There we go. That's good. Let's take this garden hoe. And even the watering can. Was there anything else in there? Uh, purple leg warmers. Fitness contra contraption. Yeah, it's fine. Does not have a... Two story? I guess not. Uh, we are very heavy loaded. I actually don't mind being heavy loaded, you know, having a heavy load on me. So I'm just going to go ahead and walk my happy butt over here and see about this place. I see a broken window. Maybe we can get some garbage bags. Yeah, there is a lot of zombies. By a lot of zombies, I mean like three. But of course, uh, being heavy loaded, you just... Oh, never mind. We're swinging very fast. Either way, you're still slow. You're slower. Slow-ish. Come on there, buddy. There we go. Yeah, we're we're just badasses. That's that's all we need to know is that we're actually fantastic. <laughs> no need to fear zombies. Let's get this closed. Uh, none of these are good. I checked that radio. I probably should, shouldn't I? Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and place it. Let's check the device. There we go. 101.8. That's good. 101.8 is our emergency broadcast. Didn't we find that? 
Did we find that? I just completely forgot. I want the garter. Thank you. I feel like we did. Oh, man. I'm, I'm going to feel so dumb if we did. People are like, oh, my God, Vinx. Why don't you ever just look at your, your other VODs? I know. I'm sorry. It takes a, I, it takes a long time. I'm sorry. You know, like, I do a lot, man. Get off my back, everybody. I'll take both. Welcome back, everybody, to another Marion tip. As you can see, I found myself a generator. But it seems that I have way too much trash in the back here. You know, literal trash. So what you can do instead of just holding this generator in your hands, you can see that everything only has a 20 yeah, other than the glove box. Well, even though the generator weighs more, it weighs 40, you can still put this in the seat even though it says it's red. Until next time, everybody. That was another Marion's tip. There it is. All right, we got to we got to get home ASAP. We got to get home ASAP. I'll probably end up just dropping a lot of the shit off. In fact, I'd say we can go through the trees. We're tired too. This is bad. I knew this was something like this was gonna happen, man. Um. Oh man, we're tired. We need a smoke. The helicopter always comes when you, like, least want it to. I guess that's kind of, like, the point, you know? Uh, we can drop our stuff off right in here. That's fine. Preferably nothing that can perish anytime soon. Money. The wine. Okay, it's gone for right now. Yikers, man. Yikers. Oh, man. Let's see. Yep, it's coming back. It's coming back now, y'all. One helicopter this time. We might be able to defend off of it. The only thing is, is that we're drowsy. Do we have... We do have vitamins. We might just need to take this entire thing of vitamins real quick. See if we can kill off this uh, fatigue. Oh, that, that was the entire thing. Feels bad. Oh, uh, yeah. Because if, if we just have exertion, we can just, you know, kind of sit on the ground. And just chain the, the ground... Um, rest until that's gone we need to take a few of these few more of these pills that's set on the ground keep our our pinky on shift wait 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 for it wait for it wait for it wait for it go Uh, 
Um, you know, we might have the weapons to deal with this. Usually by now we don't, but... Or, like, usually when the helicopter comes on 16x, we don't have the weapons to deal with the, um, the hordes that are going to come after you, but we might be able to. I mean, even if we can't, we can always just run to the, um, the shoreline. Which, that was the original plan, but... I mean... If this is all we're gonna get, we might as well just take advantage of it. Hi, Bilbo. Uh, sorry, buddy. Sorry, buddy. I'm fighting. Just do a little look de loo. Now this helicopter is gonna stay above us, but it's 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 honestly not that bad. Again, this pulls all the zombies in the area. To you. So we're going to have massive hordes. In fact, it's the helicopter is doing us a, a favor. It's pulling them that way. Um. Alright, we're getting weight again. That's good. Yeah. Yeah, we, we, we can handle this. This is fine. Yeah, usually you you would want to follow the shoreline. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. We shouldn't have a problem. We should definitely have the weaponry to, to take care of any of the zombie onslaughts. Yeah, it'll come in and out. Yeah, this is nice. That's yeah, a good thing. Get dead. We can always go back and get our, our stuff as well. And if we need to sleep, we can just go ahead and um, abuse the, fleet, the sleep function of uh, zombies not being able to hurt you while you sleep. Which is hilarious. When you see that in action, it's so good. Yeah, that's it, man. I mean, like, the, the helicopter will come more. But for the most part, yeah, like, not as many zombies. I mean, we've already killed quite a few zombies in the area. That was all the zombies in the area. That's incredible. Yeah, we've done a lot, man. We don't even have a thousand kills. We don't even have a hundred kills a day. Come on. Hey, you in that shirt. Hey, you in that shirt. Come get deadified again. Nimble level three. Let's go. That's really nice. Again. You've got three skills, or well, I guess four skills in this game that are the most important. Fitness is the absolute most important skill in this entire game. Fitness, 1,000%. Having, I'd much rather have level, you know, 10 fitness than level 10 strength. You can go the entire game and have level 5 strength and be fine. All it helps is obviously your carry weight and your strength. But we're already doing so much damage with the axe. I mean, the zombies only have roughly 160, 170 um, HP, as, especially if they're fresh like this. We do easily like 230, 250 damage on some swings. Like, we do a lot of damage. Other than these two, the next one, 1000% is Nimble. Nimble is your one of your more important agility or as skills in, in general to have and then after that it's maintenance and the rest are you're basically history you can do whatever you want you can go this entire game and not have a single point in your um crafting other than probably cooking um uh, really Salt is nay? Is that so? 
That's it, man. All right. Sure. I'm going to go drop off this stuff, and I'm going to go gr grab my other stuff. I'll be right back. Actually, no. Who cares about that? Thank you guys for watching. If you like this, please let me know down in the comments, and please consider leaving a like and subscribing to see more of this product zomboid goodness. Anyways, guys, I'll catch you in the next one. See you, bye.